Hi, Daniel from Asheville. Today, we are gonna to talk about ready mix concrete and volumetric concrete mixers. So before I talk about concrete mixers, I'm gonna give you a little introduction into concrete. So concrete is an engineering material that is a mixture of sand, stone, water, and cement. Now cement is the determining factor in how strong the concrete is. So basically, the more cement you have, the stronger the concrete will be. Concrete is the most widely used construction material on the planet. It's used for everything from roads to foundations, to floor slabs, all the way to garden sheds. So who uses concrete? everyone in the construction industry. That goes from your large-scale developers building towers like the Shard, right down to people carrying out DIY works to their gardens and front drives. When you hear people say, no job is too big or too small, in concrete, this is actually true. Now, the largest pour I remember was a 300 cubic meter pour where we were working on an environmental restoration project for a golf course. And the smallest I remember is a half a meter for somebody's garden shed. The two types of concrete mixers. One is a bottle mixer. This means that concrete is batched, put into the lorry, the lorry drives to site, and you'll see the lorry spinning as it's going along. This is to keep the concrete wet, so when they arrive at the site, the concrete can be distributed and used. Number two, these are volumetric mixers. Now the difference with volumetric mixers is that they batch on site, which means we load all the materials, i.e. sand and stone, cement and water, and any admixtures, all into the lorry at the depot, drive to site. The advantage we find of a volumetric concrete mixer is that we can visit one site and pour multiple different types of concrete. For instance, we could pour you a C20 Gen 3 for a garden shed. And in the same visit, we could provide you with a C40 for your front drive. Another advantage of volumetric concrete mixers is that you only pay for what we pour. For instance, you order five meters of concrete and we arrive and only pour four, you'll only be charged for four meters. Once we arrive on site and we're ready to get pour in, we type into the computer what exact mix it is we need and the computer will decide how much water and ballast is required to achieve the designated concrete strength. So what you can see here are all the materials being mixed in this auger and these materials are then distributed through the chute. That loud vibrating sound you can hear are vibrators which are attached to the body of the lorry to give it a shake to ensure none of the material gets stuck on any of the sides. Thanks for watching, I hope you found it informative. Please leave your comments below and let us know what you'd like to find out about next. Click here for the Asheville website. Click here to subscribe, click here for another video, and click here to see a drag race. Yes, mate. Okay. okay.